टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट गवर्निंग ऑफ इम्पल्स टर्बाइन और कंबाइंड गवर्निंग विद द हेल्प ऑफ स्पीयर एंड डिफ्लेक्टर वी नो दैट वट इज गवर्निंग गवर्निंग इज रेगुलेशन ऑफ क्वान्टिटी ऑफ वाटर जैक्टेड फ्रॉम नोजल फॉर कंट्रोलिंग द स्पीड ऑफ टर्बाइन अकॉर्डिंग टू लोड चेंजेस दिस इज कॉल्ड गवर्निंग Firstly, we will discuss about parts of the governing of impulse turbine. We have a oil sump in which we have oil, a relay or control valve with piston and piston rod, a cylinder with a piston connected to spear, impulse turbine, and nozzle. oil sump is connected with the relay or control valve with the help of pipes there are three pipes upper pipe is connected to upper of the piston and middle pipe is connected middle in the control valve and this below pipe is connected at the lower end of the control valve or below the piston and this is further connected to this sphere cylinder in which oil will be circulate according to the movement of the sphere this is governor which is connected to the turbine by different arrangement and it will give us rotation of the turbine according to the load changes this is bell crank lever bell crank lever is connected with the sleeve of the governor and this end of the bell crank lever is connected this end is connected to the deflector and this end is connected to the roller and cam this cam is attached to the spear there is a fulcrum for providing support to the lever now we see the working of governing of impulse turbine what will happen when our turbine is rotating at a speed and if this speed is increased because load is less and speed is more by the increasing of this speed this turbine shaft is connected to the mechanical linkage by this governor and this governor will also start rotation at the higher speed and sleeve will go upward of the governor this sleeve is connected to this lever and this bell crank lever will deflect the deflector and deflector will work and it will deflect the water which are coming from the nozzle then another working is this oil pump will start working and supply oil to the cylinder by the sleeve action this piston will move in the downward direction and this piston in the downward direction will supply oil from this valve to the sleeve cylinder and this cylinder this spear will move in the forward direction and decrease the area and so flow rate will be decreased and this compressed fluid will go back to the oil sump so this is the governing of impulse turbine also the reverse is possible when this piston move upward and this valve will supply from this pipe and in this cylinder oil will pressure this piston to the backward direction spear will goes in the backward direction and area will increase
and flow rate will be increased we can also deflect this deflector with the spear is connected to the cam and roller so both are combined action for the governing of impulse turbine thank you for seeing this video for more updated videos you can subscribe me on my channel learn and grow thank you